this week I was called out through an Instagram message for plagiarism. And then I put eyes right here. The Avalon fly doesn't have eyes. They trolled a net to see what kind of bait there was and there were these larger shrimp tan with some orange. And so he designed the Avalon fly to imitate a shrimp. Howdy from Texas. This is Heath Hipple with Bugs Fishing. This week I was called out through an Instagram message for plagiarism, for stealing somebody's idea uh, when I designed the clickbait shrimp. And so I've told this story many times to people. I have nothing to hide. And so let me tell you exactly what the inspiration was for the clickbait shrimp. It was the Avalon fly. There, a gentleman, um, he has an Italian name. It's hard for me to remember or pronounce, but a gentleman figured out in, I believe he was fishing in Cuba, he tied what's called an Avalon fly to catch permit. And so anytime you find something that a permit will eat, you get excited and uh, props to that guy for designing that fly that a permit would eat because permit are hard to catch. So an Avalon fly has similar to a click, like I got the idea for the beads on the mono from the Avalon fly, 100%. Um, when I read the story about the fly, he said that it, he was, it's made to imitate shrimp because on this flat where they were fishing, they like they trolled a net to see what kind of bait there was and there were these larger shrimp tan with some orange and so he designed the avalon fly to imitate a shrimp the, it's not a problem but when you look at an avalon fly it's tied on a hook it's got it's a fly it's tied on, it has some weight at the back and it has these two rabbit wings and then it has some rubber legs and it has a little bit of flashy material on the body and so when you hold it in your hand you can kind of see that that it would a fish might think that it's a shrimp but it's kind of a strange looking fly when i saw the fly i and i read the story i said first of all props to the guy for catch for designing a fly that'll catch permit but then i thought okay i love the bead idea i'm going to design a bug i'm going to design a bug with a bead idea i'm going to design a bug with the bead idea from the avalon fly that imitates a shrimp but mine's going to look more like a shrimp what i did was i put a, a rabbit wing on top and this is barred like a shrimp. I put rubber legs on the side like a shrimp. I put an, some accent rabbit right here. And then I put eyes right here. The Avalon fly doesn't have eyes. So I put eyes right here and then some feelers. And so I absolutely took inspiration from the Avalon fly, but I didn't copy it. But that's where that, that's 100% where the beads um, and that mono on the bottom come in. It helps the lure to swim upright like that and it also uh, you get a little click when you twitch it and so i have nothing to hide so i thought i'd share the inspiration um, for the clickbait shrimp those beads and that mono 100 percent were from the avalon fly the rest is all my design so this is the the new penny version of the clickbait shrimp there's five other colors this is the 16th ounce version i also we also offer an eighth ounce version We've been selling them for several years. They've caught anything that eats a small shrimp. We'll eat a clickbait shrimp, redfish, bonefish, anything else you can find. They've caught many, many species. And I hope you will try some, especially if you see fish chasing small shrimp. Catch you later.